Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am so glad that you guys came over today to see this cleaning video. This is a Sunday afternoon and on Sundays I really like to try to get my house kind of back to normal. I have the most energy in the beginning of the week, so like Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. And then after that, somehow I always lose energy. So I try to get as much done on those couple of days as I can as far as cleaning goes. So come along. I hope this motivates you to get some cleaning done in your own house and cross your fingers that I get a lot done today. So as you guys can tell, this is the worst room in my house. It's always the worst room in my house. I don't know what it is. What's the worst room in your guys' house? I think this is the worst just because it's the kitchen and things just collect. But also because I come in from my garage through here and so a lot of random stuff collects like on my washer and on my um, right when you walk in and things like that because you just kind of set stuff down and you keep going. So it's just kind of one of those places in my house so I need to really like work on that. But these dishes were actually just dishes mainly from some cooking and stuff and they were all like really big dishes they were only like a few plates and things like that but they were all like bigger bowls and things like that from things I had made for 4th of July and uh, dinner and things like that so this was really kind of a continuation of some dishes that I did the day before and yeah everything fit and it was great but sometimes I feel like I cannot get caught up on these dishes. And I know I've been saying that in the last couple of videos. So if you have any good ideas for me, <laughs> that would be wonderful. Because sometimes I feel like everything doesn't fit in the dishwasher. And then I, for some reason, really want everything to go through the dishwasher for sanitation reasons. I don't know if that's just me or but I feel like nothing can live in that hot of water so I want everything to kind of go through the dishwasher that can go through the dishwasher so I end up kind of getting behind sometimes so yeah that's kind of where I was at today So I just wanted to pop on really quick and tell you guys that cleaning the sink is my favorite part in cleaning videos. I have no idea what it is, but I love doing it. My last couple ones, um, I just couldn't because I had dishes that still needed to be in the sink. And so I really wanted to get my sink good and kind of scrubbed down because I just felt like even though stuff was clean that had been sitting in there, I don't know, for some reason I just really wanted to scrub down my sink and get it kind of smelling back to normal and everything good and you can really see like how hot that water was and this just gives me so much satisfaction does this for you guys too i love it when people clean their sinks side note we went to the baseball game a couple days ago and that was what my dip and dots came in that little cap right there so that's why it's sitting there. My son really wanted to keep it and who am I to say no don't keep it. So that was why it was just randomly there and I noticed it. So I also wanted to ask you guys a really funny question. Um, do you guys use pods or liquid soap in your dishwasher? Because I am noticing that I think the pods worked better but is there really a difference? I, I'm not sure and I think it was on Tell Vacuum Do This Part where she said that she had done some research and she said that the pods worked better because the dishwashers were made for them now or something like that. But I have no idea, but I feel like the dishwashing liquid I've been using, it's the same brand and everything and I get it from Costco. The only difference is I really like using the Cascade with bleach for some reason. I don't know. It's just a sanitation thing. I know it sounds silly, but I really think that the pods are actually doing better for some reason. So I can't decide if it's the soap without the bleach in it that I'm not liking or if it's the pods. So let me know. Do you guys have a preference and 
what is your preference because I just feel like I'm not super happy right now. will be happy to note that I finally remember to get paper towels at the store yesterday but I did not have them for so long and so I was just using a dish towel um, because that was what I had and that was what was clean it was a clean dish towel don't get me wrong but I didn't have any of my Norex cloths all that was in the laundry so I just used what I had on hand and I you'll see I end up throwing it in the washing machine afterwards but I think sometimes even though it's out of the ordinary and it seems different like use what you have and just go on with your day and don't let it ruin your day on this particular day I even used it to clean my microwave I just felt like I needed to kind of um, wipe that down I felt like it hadn't been wiped down in about a week and I like to stay on top of that so nothing gets really like stuck on or anything like that um, as you can see, I have this weird thing on my counter. Um, it's actually a container that had dog food in it and it had like bowls and toys and stuff because I was dog sitting somebody's uh, dogs overnight and they were the cutest things. They were so much fun to have overnight and got my dog fix in and did them a favor and everything worked out. But I just kind of had to leave that up there because I really didn't have any place for it at the time. So that's why this weird thing is on my counter, but I didn't want to just, you know, lay it on the floor somewhere either. So yeah, that's kind of what was going on. And um, of course, on this day, I had laundry and I usually do laundry about every day. I know everybody has their own laundry routines and I would love to do a video on a laundry routine, but I really don't necessarily have one because I try to do laundry every single day like a load every single day I hate getting behind well for some reason in my life right now I'm just in this season where I can't get caught up so I had a couple of loads that needed to get done so I was trying to get that all taken care of to date as well so I thought I would bring you along give you that kind of cleaning motivation too I need you guys' opinion. I really am thinking about chalk painting my table white and recovering my seats. Uh, this table is about 10 years old. It has done us good. Oh my gosh. When I clean it, it looks like I look, put a lot of product on it, but y'all, it just soaks right in. I have no idea why. So I'm kind of nervous about painting it, but I really think that it would be fun. And it is an over 10 year old table, so I have definitely got my wear out of it and I think it would be good to have a facelift but what's your thoughts on it let me know I would be really curious so in this bathroom today I really just had to go in and kind of tidy up I guess you could say and just do a few little things I had washed the mats and cleaned the bathroom I want to say yesterday and I was doing kind of my weekly stuff that I need to do and I just did that really quick kind of in between when I was in and out of my house and it worked out really good but I kind of had to go back in today and put the bath mats down and things like that so you'll see that I kind of just did uh, some wipe downs and all that because I have a boy who uses this bathroom so I always want to make sure that it is a hundred percent clean because you never know um, sometimes there's toothpaste sometimes there's other stuff you just never know so I went ahead and wiped down my um, sink vanity as you can tell with just a disinfecting cloth and then I just happened to notice that there was some hair and stuff that had collected and dust really on the grooves in the molding right there so I went ahead and wiped all of that down with a disinfectant cloth and that worked out really really well my husband actually uses this bathroom the majority of the time so a lot of times um, will have like uh, beard hair or something like that because you know he uses this bathroom so I will always want to keep a, a sharp eye on all that but I think it turned out really good for just a good 
wipe down. I just felt so fresh and clean. My new weekly routine video will be up on Thursday, so you all come back and check that out. That is just where I am in my season of life right now and what I'm cleaning weekly. Some things are different, some things are the same, and it's just kind of been a busy summer so far, and I'm sure you guys are feeling the same way. So I wanted to kind of put it out there about how things have changed, but also how they have stayed the same. So I will see you guys in my next brand new video. I look forward to talking to you all in the comments and hearing all of your wonderful opinions. And we'll see you next time. Bye for now.